38 ways to organize and declutter your garage. 1. Use a slat wall to hang and organize smaller accessories. Add as many hooks and baskets as you need. 2. Or try a pegboard wall one instead. 3. Keep every tool in its proper place with outlines. 4. Have a spare chest of drawers hanging around? Turn them into a workbench. This beautiful workbench was made using the RAS chest from IKEA. 5. Install a set of old school lockers and assign one to each member of your family. Where do you find old lockers? Keep an eye on eBay, Etsy, or Craigslist. 6. Create extra space and store bikes vertically. This is actually an IKEA hack using a Stolman post. 7. Or hang them from the ceiling. Just make sure the hooks are secure. 8. Get some air with a sliding screen door. If you spend a lot of time in your garage, or if you live in an area plagued by mosquitoes and other bugs, you may want to invest in one. Link in video description. 9. Have a no shoes allowed in the house policy? Maximize floor space and store them on a rack instead of the ground. 10. Or use a stack of vintage crates. An old bottle holder is great for storing scarves, hats, and mittens. 11. Repurpose empty coffee cans as miniature recycling centers. Store them alongside your larger paper, plastic, and glass recycling containers. 12. Garages can be a pretty dreary place, so add some color and paint the door that goes into your house. 13. Turn a corner of your garage into a mudroom. 14. Conserve space with a fold-up work table. This is a great option for people with small spaces or those who don't plan to use a garage as a workshop very frequently. 15. Store screws and nails in old gum containers. So do not throw away those handy lidded containers. 16. Use slices of PVC pipe to hold your gardening tools. 17. Put a pallet to work as sports equipment storage. 18. Keep sport balls contained with a wire wall basket. It's no good to have them rolling around the garage floor and getting under the car. 19. Have an athletic family? Build a rolling sports good storage cart. Push it into the yard and play ball. 20. Easily move your tools to whatever corner of the garage you're working in with this DIY caddy. Of course it's made from pegboards. Link in video description. 21. Hang your fishing rods from the ceiling rack to keep them out of the way. 22. Store your spray paint in a shoe organizer. 23. Construct a storage tower to place in an empty corner. These shelves are the perfect size for keeping tubs on. 24. You don't need to be an expert handyman to build these simple shelves. You just need some wood and brackets. 25. Install a beam to hang wet jackets and snow pants on. These can drip dry in the garage instead of the entryway. 26. Don't leave bicycles and scooters toppled over in a corner. Use a rack to safely park them. This DIY option even includes hooks for hanging helmets on. Link in video description. 27. Or create a designated parking space for your children's vehicle using tape. They'll even learn how to parallel park at a young age. 28. If you really want to house your children's driving toys in style, make them their own mini garage. 
This way they're protected from the elements, but not taking up space in your actual garage. 29. Hang up a magnetic strip to hold screwdrivers, wrenches, and scissors, or paintbrushes, anything with some metal. 30. Utilize the space above your garage door with mounted shelving. This would be a good place to store holiday decorations and other things you don't need all that frequently. 31. Use large metal buckets to store children's outdoor toys. If you think the contents of the buckets will change frequently, you can make them easily erasable labels using chalk and chalkboard paint. 32. Painting a concrete floor makes it easier to clean and helps protect your garage from mildew. If you stain it, you can paint it again. It's pretty darn easy. 33. But if you're stuck with plain concrete, spruce it up with this miracle cleaner. You probably already have the ingredients on hand. Link in video description. 34. Do a lot of building? Make yourself a lumber cart to organize your supplies. This way you can easily figure out what you need or don't need before you head off to Home Depot. 35. Of course, the easiest way to organize scrap wood is to dump it in a bucket. 36. Consolidate leftover paint into jars. 37. After painting a room, save a swatch of the paint color for future reference. This way, when you need to touch up the walls in your bathroom, you'll know that you used Rustic Sunset, not Orange Glow. 38. And if you can't find the place for something, put it in a tub. Emergency kits, tarps, camping goods, saws, a tub for everything. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more organizing and do-it-yourself ideas for your home.